Welcome to Sonic Wall Video Solutions. My name is Kritika Nakshatri. Today we will demonstrate how to allow access between the wireless and LAN zones. To allow access between wireless and LAN zones, we need to first configure the wireless and LAN interfaces with the required IP scheme. We then create rules between the zones based on the access level required. Today for demonstration, we are using a SonicWall NSA220 with the firmware version 5.9.0.3. Currently under Network Interfaces, we have X0 configured as our default LAN and X4 is set up as a wireless LAN interface. If we go to the Firewall tab, Access Rules, click on drop down boxes, from zone is wireless LAN, to zone is LAN. We see that by default from wireless to the LAN all traffic is denied. If you require complete access between the wireless and LAN zones, you can click on the edit button on this particular rule and set the action to allow. This will allow complete access between the wireless and the LAN. If you check the other way around, go to the drop down boxes, from zone is LAN, to zone wireless LAN, we see that by default all services are allowed. Going back to the wireless to LAN access rule, in a scenario where you do not require all the wireless systems to be able to access the LAN and require only specific IPs or a range of IPs to be able to access the LAN resources, you can set this particular rule to deny. We then create another rule here where we set the service to any, source, choose create new network. You can name the address object as per your requirement here for demonstration, we call it wireless IPs. Zone assignment is WLAN. Type can be either host or a range. For demonstration, we set it to a range and we give the range of 172, 1.12 to 1.20. Destination can either be a specific IP or a range of IPs or you can choose any. Click on Add. You need to make sure that the allow rule has a higher priority than the deny rule. To set priorities, you can click on the priority arrow on the rule and set the priority as per your requirement. You can also add rules based on specific services. For example, we add a deny rule here for service SMTP. So no SMTP traffic will be allowed from the wireless LAN to the LAN. Here as well, you can set the priorities to the rules. If you require the wireless IP range to be able to send or receive SMTP traffic, you can set the priority of this particular rule as 1. So only the specified IPs will be able to send SMTP traffic, while the others will be denied from the same. This brings us to the end of this video on how to allow access between wireless and LAN networks. To learn more about Dell SonicWorld security products, please visit sonicworld.com. For more video tutorials, visit dellsoftware.com/support. I hope this has been informative and thank you for viewing.